Without question, everybody gets hungry on a diet. You have to go through that hunger. That's, you know, you're losing fat at that point. So, you know, a little bit of hunger is unavoidable. You just have to go through it. But there's some tips and there's some strategies to help with hunger while you're on a fat loss diet. You know, a big thing for me that I've always truly believed in was if I'm really hungry, I'm going to go for a walk or I'm going to hit some sort of uh, light activity that's not, you know, overly strenuous, but it's going to be enough to, you know, get my mind right to start, you know, that positive self-talk with, yeah, I'm getting diced, I'm getting shredded, I'm, you know, losing fat here, I'm getting the body that I want. So that talk usually comes, you know, on a walk, um, like a couple, a few minutes into it. I'm like, yeah, like I'm, 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 lo I'm shredding fat here. I'm getting that body. I'm, I'm getting those abs. So that's, you know, that's a good thing that I usually like to do, and it works for everybody. So, you know, put that in your pocket. Um, I'll hit an ab workout. You know, that's that one's really key. You know, also because, you know, why do we all diet? And all? we all of us want abs. We all want abs. There's not a person that I haven't met that doesn't want abs. So when you're hunger, when, when you're hungry and you're going through it, you know, hitting abs is a real, you know, positive reinforcement of what you want. You know, like I'm a little hungry, but uh, look at me, I'm working these abs out. You know, you go immediate from I'm hungry, immediately to focus like, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm doing this. Like I'm getting what I want. It, it's so positive and it's so reinforcing that after you're done, you're not going to be as hungry and, you know, you're going to continue on with what you got to do. Lastly, Diet Coke. This is, you know, tremendous, tremendous, tremendous. If, you know, I'll do all three of those things in one sitting. And it, after that, I'm not even, I mean, I could still be hungry a little bit, but, you know, I've built myself up with the positive talk self-talk with the positive action that now, you know, I, I, I can bear it, you know, and that's what you want to do, you know, but the Diet Coke really does help for some reason. It just gets, it just zaps that hunger just a little bit, you know, more, it just does it just a little bit to make you be able to, able to endure what you're going through. All right. This is all necessary. We all want abs. But this is what it takes, you know, it, it's having these little tips and strategies to help get you through. Because the last thing you want to do is focus on the hunger. And then if you keep focusing on it, the next thing you know, you're just going to, you know, eat something. And then you're going to probably end up binge eating and just set you back to square one. And that's the feeding. And then next thing you know, you're just eating bullshit all the time. And you've completely gone off the rails. And you've undo, you've undid all the fat loss and you give up. I know it's a trend that I see all the time, but the importance is keeping your word and having these strategies that help you, you know, overcome when the hunger does kick in.